We are here at Oracle State Park, here in southern Pinal County, just north of Tucson. Did you want to look again? I want to look again. We have some telescopes set up over here. Step right up, folks. That's Jupiter, the biggest planet in the solar system. It's about 513 million miles away. They may be able to see a comet over here in the western sky. You'll see the winter Milky Way overhead, because we do have these beautiful dark skies up here. Did you see that? Amateur astronomers, they love sharing what they see in their telescopes. Unlike a lot of other hobbyists who really don't share stuff, astronomers want to share. These moons go around in two or three days. This is a very special park here at Oracle State Park. We're kind of out of the way. We're kind of known as a hidden gem. But because we're in a dark location, well away from the city lights, we have this beautiful night sky. We want to protect it. We in Dark Sky, Southern Arizona's chapter, help folks understand what light pollution is. We speak in terms of glare, of sky glow, of light trespass. If we were to look at a, a large city from afar, we can see that dome over the city. That is the light pollution that's escaping up into the atmosphere. And that's, that's wasteful light, wasteful energy. And the easiest solution to that, obviously, is just to turn the light off. Well, that would be a simple solution, but we obviously need light. But we need the right kind of light. We need light that's shielded, that's pointed downward. It provides safety, but it's not blinding, it's not glaring. Many cities in our country and throughout the world are so badly polluted that citizens within those cities have never seen the night sky. They look up, they don't see stars, they certainly don't see the Milky Way. International Dark Sky Week is April 2nd through the 8th. And what we are asking them to do is be aware, is to, in their neighborhood, in their cities, look and identify what they believe is obnoxious light, is infringing light, and work with their neighbors, with their community, to make sure that the light is used only where it's necessary and use the right type of light. A lower temperature light, a softer light, amber works beautifully. So we're asking them to get engaged and work towards reducing the amount of light pollution. People up here in Oracle, and in fact all over the state of Arizona, come to Oracle State Park because we are an international dark sky park. They want you to come up and look through that eyepiece and ask questions about what is this I'm seeing through the eyepiece. They don't care whether you're six years old, 60 years old, they want you to look through that and just get this beautiful appreciation of what's out there in our universe.